I haven't always been in a wheelchair. I'm 30 years old now, but I became paralyzed when I was 12 years old due to an autoimmune condition called transverse myelitis. You know, it just, I mean, it was the best and worst day of my life. I remember waking up that day, uh, February 5th, 1999, just like any other day, dressing myself, going to school, eating breakfast, hanging out with my friends, going to basketball practice, and suddenly I had a hard time catching my breath, like I couldn't breathe. So I set out and I got this massive headache, the worst pain I've ever felt. Terrified, of course, um, thinking that whatever is going on, it can be resolved and you know I'll be walking again. About a week's worth of testing, they came back with transverse myelitis. And of course, I didn't know what that meant. Okay, now what? When I first came home, it was kind of, um, Everything in, the, in my room was the same, my friends are the same, but I'm now different. It was just kind of that moment of realization that, you know, my life's never going to be the same. You can really get affected by, you know, society's inaccessibility and, you know, kind of knows all the time. And I think scuba diving for me was kind of my yes. It was my answer and my solution. And I'm just, um, it's the best thing on the planet. You know, being able to do something so extreme as scuba diving and so fun, um, and something I can do with my family, it was, it was just the moment where I realized I want to do this and have this opportunity for other people. My dad is Alan Sir Jr. and my grandpa is Alan Sir Sr. and my uncle is Bobby Unser and you know, kind of, my family is really well known in sort of the auto racing world, the Indianapolis 500. My dad's won it twice, and my grandpa's won it four times, and my uncle's won it three times. So we're kind of a winning family, I guess. Um, and I kind of use sort of that spirit or that champion spirit, um, you know, in life in general is, you know, you're not always going to win, but you're not going to always lose either. And um, to have a winning attitude is, is something that I think helps you propel in life. I think it was, and this is what I love about scuba diving, is that it's a very challenging sport. I mean, it's not easy, um, but it took me out of my disability element. I really love making an impact for people and kind of ha having the opportunity to you know, change or influence perspectives, and especially when it comes to the world of disability and paralysis. And so that's why we started the Cody Unser First Set Foundation. And it kind of evolved from there, from awareness to advocacy for quality of life, you know, being here, doing things, uh, creating or developing, you know, anything that you want to do, it starts with one step. So, um, and I think scuba diving is a perfect example of that. You know, you start with training and then you go on and advance and stuff. So, um, but it is that first step that really matters. One of the things I think that I've learned the most from Cody and the biggest impact she's had on my life as a scuba instructor is that I've learned that she doesn't take things for granted and she just puts herself out there. She has a sense of fortitude, of compassion, and of trailblazing, unlike any other person I've met. She seizes opportunities for things that um, she finds interesting to her and she is great at um, evolving some of those ideas into realities that has much larger impact on herself. It impacts like an entire community and I'm not talking just about the disabled community, I'm talking about community of people as a whole. I think scuba diving is a healing sport, it is a healing activity. Uh, not only physically because you're active, you're getting on and off a boat, you're putting gear on a wetsuit, so it is kind of exercise in that sense, um, but I think also kind of mentally and emotionally it actually does really affect you and really impact your life and allows you to, to question, you know, how can I do something else or when can I do something else? And, um, but it's, it's been awesome to be kind of, again, part of this whole movement of wellness and, and to think that diving can actually have an effect on that is so cool, so awesome. Cody has inspired me with her, her just her overall zest for life. It's, it's very, um, she's definitely a role model. She's taught me to not be afraid of trying something new and don't, don't fear disappointment. If it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be, but it, it shouldn't stop you from trying to conquer something. Personally for me, I think I had to go through a traumatic event, such as becoming paralyzed, to actually um, sort of tap into a stronger self. If I can go back in time, you know, I wouldn't change a thing. 
My name is Cody Unser and I'm a Patty Diver.